Why good morning everybody? <laughs> what is up you guys? I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today I want to do a little challenge for myself is to vlog only with the DJI Action 2 and the Insta360. Now in the past I used to do challenges like vlog only with the phone camera. Today we will have two action camera that I have and I have never used it solely by its own. Oh, good morning, Squirt! <laughs> She's ready for the sun. We're gonna start off with 7-Eleven for breakfast. <laughs> and then we're gonna ride around and I'm gonna take Squirt around all the interesting sights in Phuket. Okay? Alright, at least she gets to see Phuket a bit. Breakfast is served. Uh, Jaga. <laughs> Toasties. Sandwiches. And of course, drinks. Ready, Squirt? Hot day today. <laughs> you don't need a mask when you're in a motorbike. Woohoo! Super hot. Burning my butt. Maybe when we met, I was kinda lonely. I had lost my groove. No one there to hold me. the beach first stop on our road trip Karon Beach now I brought you guys on this little road trip little tour around Phuket before and the first stop I've always liked to stop is at Karon Beach because simply it is magnificent like look at that water look at that clear beach no ships on the horizon right squid no ships <laughs> In Singapore, you'll see ships around. Here, no ships. And look, look at that. All the beach umbrella and relaxing. What do you think of this beach? Clean. Clean? Enough. Clean enough. <laughs> yeah. It's beautiful. And actually, if you wear this, you can see how clear the water is. Look at that. Look at that side. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good with shades. <laughs> Yo guys, the next time I come here, look, 200 baht for one whole fried fish. <laughs> Wonder if you're sleeping in now. But you're in you two in that bed, it's stuck in my head. Did it break you? Like it broke me. Had it been, we give it all up, we give it up. Here at Kata Beach now, you get like a few drink vendors. I think there's a massage place here and lots of beach chairs, umbrellas. But it's not bigger than uh, Karan Beach. Kata Beach is a little bit more curvy. Here is also one of the best beaches in Phuket. What do you think, Scott? Hot. Very hot? Hot. <laughs> You can cook egg. Okay, it is pretty hot here. About to leave. Already packing. Come with me. I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action. What 
we can be Live with no distractions We'll get away This is what we waited for This is Caron viewpoint. <laughs> Nothing that I haven't brought you guys before, but then Squirt, this is your first time here. How's the view? <laughs> I've shown you guys this place before and then I mentioned to you that my grandfather used to bring me here. You know? Oh wow. It says drone zone. So you can actually fly the drone here. <laughs> well too bad I didn't bring the drone out today. Oh, and then if you can see right up over at the edge of the hill there Yeah, in between somewhere there You can see like the big Buddha I feel like this is like my every Phuket trip tour kind of thing Like one of the days I would go and visit all the same usual sites in Phuket <laughs> Just to, um, you know, memories You can go up and you can see a better view if you go up Up the stairs where I used to play with my grandfather. <laughs> Climbing up the stairs like that, like so. Wow. <laughs> you look at that view. Just stunning and beautiful. <laughs> Wanna be the person that you call up when you're down? Wanna be the first who knows all of your deepest secrets Can I be the one who wakes you up before you miss your ride? Cause I wanna be close to you And I wanna show you something new You gotta know Every day I got your back, yeah you can count on me for that So put your hand in mine, I will be Sick of the climb, I will make sure it's okay. I you didn't ask for any of this, but we reach for the sky. That's for flying colors now. <laughs> this is one of the popular sites in Phuket that everybody comes here but I don't know why they come here because if they say it's a lighthouse it does not look like a lighthouse there is like a temple <laughs> don't worry there's not a lot of stairs now I've come here a lot of times before but never with the Insta360 so I thought like I'll show you the view with the Insta360 over here it's just like a huge, huge, massive space on the southern part of Phuket. If you look right in front of me here, you get this massive view with like a little island on the left. <laughs> the wind turbine all the way on the right. And squirt over here. <laughs> so up over here, there is like a little stairs leading up slightly to like a shrine, temple and that's where the lighthouse is supposed to be Look at that, that big Buddha tree back there And look at this 
Lots of elephant. Squirt is already taking her camera out. <laughs> we have uh, a circle of elephants all around the shrine. And straight in front of me, this is supposed to be the lighthouse. <laughs> I mean, it's not your usual lighthouse that you see around the world. It seriously looks more like a, a temple, you know? Or a monument, see? <laughs> it's good to be back in Phuket. Last day here in Phuket, making a full use out of the whole day today. Lighthouse temple and let's see the view from above. Woo! <laughs> it's beautiful, guys. Phuket, it's beautiful. <laughs> Always love coming here. What do you think, Squirt? Very similar to Japan. <laughs> <laughs> Only uh, here's a little hot, right? Ready to go to Big Buddha? Yep. Hmm? Yep. Okay, let's go to the Big Buddha. I could feel it in my bones. There was something going on. That shade of doubt hanging around that old. Cause darling, there is nothing right. When all you seem to do is lie. Those days are gone I walk and talk While you're alone When I think about the way We used to be When I think about the things You took from me I know that I am so much better Better When I look at what I've done I know that we are apart When I look at what I've won finally made it to the big Buddha and for those of you who have followed me for a long time you guys know the routine you guys know that every time when I come to Phuket I would visit the big Buddha so here we are once again and of course every time when I come it's usually with different friends so <laughs> they have to see it for themselves for the first time and the good thing is sport is dressed up properly to go to the temple Long sleeve, long pants, they can't say anything about it. So the last time you were here, you did not go to the Big Buddha, right? <laughs> Even on my first vlog to Phuket, when I visited the Big Buddha, it was like on construction. And I think it's like seven years after that from my first vlog over here, it's still on construction. <laughs> when will this finish? When will this ever be completed? But as always, the view here is amazing. This is a nice one. <laughs> Squirt says this is a nice one. Like you could see the whole kit from here. <laughs> Alright, getting up. Going up. Come on, Squirt. Climb, 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 climb. Those stairs. The whole trip is all about stairs. <laughs> So you're only allowed to climb up the stairs from here but you're not allowed to come down the stairs from here you got to come down from the back side as you can see from around it's pretty much not uh, completed because there's lots of construction work going around i wish that they finish it by now <laughs> so I always come to the big Buddha usually it's at the start of my trip you know or midway of my trip I come here to ask for blessing for a safe trip <laughs> but this time I visit the big Buddha the last day of my trip so it's like kind of like thank you for the safe trip <laughs> now we go head back to the hotel and go find Christina I think she's awake by now you think <laughs> and this would be the end of the Action 2 and the Insta360 footage. We're going back to the cannon from here. 
<laughs> Hi, good morning. Good morning. We go walk around? Bye-bye. Yeah. <laughs> Bye-bye. We go walk around? Yeah. Okay. We made it to Patong Beach. It only took about 10 minutes to walk here instead of 20 minutes to bike here and be miserable. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> but yeah, this is the wrap up. Another beach, but a lot more crowded and a lot more busier. More busy. Or busier. There is no more busier. And we got a teacher here. <laughs> if I'm being honest, I've never walk or stroll along the beach of Patong Beach. And look, there's a skate park here. <laughs> yeah, if I had my roller skates. You would do wonders and magic, right? <laughs> girls, would, girls would be screaming like that. And you break your wrist. <laughs> yeah, but girls would scream. <laughs> Can we have a song for a skate park? He was a skater boy. She said, see you later boy. Oh, you know that. Wow, <laughs> Evra Levine. Yeah. <laughs> she just stopped by and she's like, I want to sit in the swing. This <laughs> is what happens when you plan nothing. <laughs> Don't plan anything. Don't plan anything. <laughs> then you can swing on a swing. Hit yourself because Lionel is throwing you into a tree. I move. Didn't move. I'm <laughs> trying not to hit you. <laughs> High five. <laughs> <laughs> so we are now here at the end of the Patong Beach. Uh, Christina and I, we are just getting a little watermelon shake at the back here. And as you can see, I will always ride here past the Dolphin Roundabout. <laughs> and here, there's also another shrine. Thank you. What? 100 baht for two watermelon shakes. 50 baht each. Cheers. <laughs> I must say guys, I've been living a much more healthier life, counting my calories, drinking watermelon shake, losing a bit of walking instead of riding, yeah, and walking comfortably because of my Crocs. <laughs> Crocs! Okay, you changed me. Okay, fine. So tonight is the last day. It's the last vlog. I would say this is the last vlog. You'll be like, finally, yes, no more cameras. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is our last vlog in Phuket. I don't know what's the next vlog gonna be. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> but uh, yeah, what's your recap and summary for the whole trip? What do you think? Will you be coming back for another trip again in the future or not? I, look, I came to Thailand once. No, no, I not Thailand. It. We go to another place. Oh, we go to another yeah. place? So how is that recapping? No, I mean, we recap for this trip and then say if we would go to another place. Okay, so I'm recapping the trip. Yes. I came once to Thailand. <laughs> <laughs> I loved it. I yeah. did not need to ever come back. We are not coming back ever again, including Aonang Krabi. Okay. No more tap. Can I can I recap <laughs> on my own or you want to do this? Okay, then you hold it. <laughs> I went to Thailand. <laughs> I loved it. I never needed to come back again. I ticked my Thailand box. I wanted to keep it a good, perfect memory. <laughs> Lionel insisted that I come back because apparently he didn't believe that I saw it the first time. I think he believes I see it now. I hope he believes I see it now. I have no desire to come back to Thailand. Even for Tep? <sighs> is there a mute button on you? He is waiting. He says next year. I didn't finish. Okay. okay. I have no desire to come back to Thailand. <laughs> However, <laughs> however, yes, this is the however part. <laughs> I am in love with Tep. Mm -hmm. I would like to say visit Singapore, which I want to visit frequently for the rest of my life because I love it and it's not a box for me. It wasn't a, oh, I just want to go and see it and, and then and leave. Message box. for Tep. Tell if this video has a Tep, T-H-E-P message to Tep. What is the message to Tap if he's watching this video? I love you, wait for me. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I want to go to Singapore again many times because it's not a box for me, it's a home for me. 
And so when I go home to Singapore, I would not mind coming for the weekend to see my lover, Tep. <laughs> if, he, if he accepts my love. Do you? Write in the comments below. <laughs> Tep, write Do in the comments. Do you love me back? <laughs> Do you miss me? When you said come back next year, did you mean it? Or were you just looking for that tip? Not the one he gave, the one I gave on top of the one he gave. Oi, oi. <laughs> I gave him 100. And so did I. <laughs> so he got a 200 baht tip. For a 200 baht massage. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he came in on his day off. <laughs> did, did we even say that? He came on his day off. And just he to deserved, massage her. Just to massage me, uh. which I think means he loves me. Um, <laughs> <laughs> He's probably massaging another girl right now. <sighs> Look, I know that you don't like it. <laughs> I know it's just for the money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would I would come back just to see Tep, but I don't want to see Thailand again. I would I on my list, not Lionel's list, is I want to go to Korea and Cambodia. That's where I wanted to go. Um, so I would still like to go those places. And that's my recap and where I would like to go next. <laughs> I also want to go to Machu Picchu, that's true. Leave your comments down below. Would you prefer us to go to Korea or Cambodia or Machu Picchu? Let's have a vote. Our Tep, next trip. If you even vote once, it will outweigh every <laughs> other vote. <laughs> well, this is it. Last night in Phuket, last night in Thailand, and wrapping up this whole trip. This whole trip has been a big experience. <laughs> and for once in my life, I never ever thought I would feel this way, but I'm ready to go back to Singapore. <laughs> I mean, man. I miss Singapore, can you believe it? But it's not like I hate Thailand, it's just that, okay, you know what? I dislike the weed, I dislike the smell of the cannabis, I dislike the smell of smoke, like everywhere you walk around, you still smell that. That is my biggest complaint over here in Thailand because in the past they didn't have this, so I love Thailand a lot, but because right now they legalize cannabis, you smell it everywhere. You <laughs> you walk on the street, you smell it. The only thing is like if you ride the bike, you don't smell it so much because you're on the road and you just go one place to another place. But if you're like walking along the street, man, you are bound to smell it like at least three or four times in a hundred meter walk. <laughs> and I'm not even kidding. People just smoke freely here, you know? Let me take a little stroll along the pool side because <laughs> this is my last night enjoying the pool before we go to dinner what can i say what have i learned on this trip well i've learned so much because i've never gone on a trip a month-long trip with christina ever and i've learned so much with her and she taught me so much stuff uh, in terms of filming in terms of the production and acting and all this stuff health wise as well um, rehab quitting smoking losing weight counting calories <laughs> It's a crash course <laughs> and I felt like I had lots of energy but my mind is a little burned out but uh, I'm feeling a lot better I'm feeling a lot healthier now no cigarettes eating healthy I mean you won't notice the difference until you stop now that I've stopped I'm able to taste food a lot better appreciate smell a lot better now I'm happy I'm glad I saved myself on this trip Back on the streets again, and we're going for dinner! Dinner, yay! Dinner! <laughs> no one's excited. <laughs> and tonight, we are having dinner at Savoy. Over here. This is a very popular restaurant. It's been here for a very long time now, so let's check it out. Can we have a table for three? Okay. Look at all the fish. Kitchen. Look at your pineapple fried rice. Sweet and sour chicken. Okay, my fried rice with everything separated. <laughs> and tom yum soup. Finally, the first tom yum soup for the Thailand trip. <laughs> yeah, I haven't had tom yum soup yet, but finally, tom yum soup. And Christina enjoying the green curry chicken as always. I feel like you eat green curry chicken every day. 
I don't. <laughs> Almost. I had um, cashew nut chicken yesterday. Okay, but all the time green curry chicken. That's because there's so few things on the menu that doesn't have fish in it. It's not because I don't like other things, it's because they just like, you want shrimp? And I'm like, no. And they're like, well, we can't help you then. <laughs> Yo, man, dinner wasn't that um, impressive. <laughs> the food was just all right, but the price, man, Savoy, <laughs> your price is overpriced. The whole meal like that cost us like 1,600 baht. I think that's a little on the high end for Thailand standard. I mean, if you count about Singapore, that's like 60, 70 dollars. Singapore for three person meal, it's all right, yeah? But then if you count like for Thailand standard, that's a, on the high end, you know? How was it? <laughs> you felt it? Ooh, you make yeah. him hot. I made him work very hard. <laughs> <laughs> he's always laughing because he's like, too small. Too small. Too small? Yeah, because he's trying to like stand on me, but he's like falling off because there's no body to stand on. <laughs> but at least he's standing. And I feel it. Is he better than Tip? No. No, but I will say that he gives the best hand massage in Thailand. Okay, hand massage. Yeah, like, like he massages hands like the best I've ever experienced. He cracked my surgery knuckle, <laughs> which is a feat, let me tell you. So, second best in Thailand. Second best in Thailand. Tap two. Tap two. <laughs> So anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed today's vlog and we will see you in the next one. Maybe will Poppy? No, you will. I will. You'll see them in the next one. I don't know. Actually, I think they see you. I don't know if you ever see them. <laughs> <laughs> you guys keep smiling. See ya! And also, I must add that the dress, well, stay tuned. We don't know what's the result going to be yet. Negative! Because they messed <laughs> up somehow, right, Christina? <laughs> um, yeah, because they took my measurements, but completely ignored the fact that I said I want to wear this bra with it. And they heard, no bra! <laughs> and I heard, a bra! And they said, okay, we sew in cups. And I said, that's not a bra, I want to wear this bra with it. <laughs> and they're like, is it happy to do this bra? I'm like, okay, so either my bra is going to show or my boob is going to show. Either way, it's not working for me. <laughs> so, um, they're going to deliver the dress at 4 a.m. <laughs> or 5 a.m. It is 4 a.m. and our little squirt is sleeping so we have to whisper but we finally got the dress. Are you happy with it? No, my bra is hidden. <laughs> if they would have listened and take her bra. The bra, if they just would have taken the bra. It, it would, would have, have been, been perfect. so much. Yeah, just take the bra, return the bra at the same time with the dress. At least you know the measurement. It's easy. I would say if you're going to ever yeah. get a dress yeah. within three days, yes. don't get any seaming on it. I got a buttload of seaming and that's why they couldn't handle it. <laughs> I mean, the woman sewed it in, in a couple hours <laughs> overnight. Yeah. You were more excited about the dress than I was. I just wanted to go to the wedding. <laughs> <laughs> I have no affinity. Okay. Um, but what if it's the wedding with Tap? Then why am I not in a white dress? Oh yeah! <laughs> Obviously! <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Leave your comments down below. Which do you think is better? Tap or Tap 2? <laughs> no, no, no! Tap or Pawn? Come on, they are confusing. <laughs> okay, Tap, tap or pawn. pawn. Which is more uh, better looking? There's only one vote that matters. <laughs> Your vote. Taps. Because Tep's watching and Pond's not. He can't oh. even vote for himself. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's, that's true. Sorry, Tap. Tap, if you're watching, uh, it, it's only you. <laughs> no, 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 no. You taught them this. You taught them. Korean yeah. Korean hat. <laughs>